Early Saturday morning, California lawmakers passed a sanctuary state bill. The bill is directed towards limiting the ways that state and local officials can cooperate with federal immigration enforcement. California houses more undocumented immigrants than any other state, and so it seems only fitting the state would begin to offer the highest protection available for non-citizens anywhere in the U.S. Measures range from treating schools and courthouses as safe zones to restricting the ability of law enforcement to detain people on behalf of federal immigration officers. This is in stark contrast to former Maricopa County Sheriff Joe Arpaio's policy of illegally targeting Latinos in order to turn them over to ICE. Being labeled as sanctuary basically means the state will not go out of its way to help the federal government deport people. On Friday, Democratic state lawmakers argued that undocumented immigrants are crucial in contributing to the state's economy and culture, and that state and local resources should not be used to tear families apart. Additionally, they stated some children without legal status are too afraid to go to school, and police statistics have shown a drop in reports of sexual assault and domestic violence as immigrant victims have refused to come forward. It should be noted that this does not mean that people in California will not be deported. ICE authorities will continue to operate in California. However, it's much more of a challenge for ICE to pursue individuals when local officials do not provide as much aid. Of course, we'll keep you posted as this story develops. Thanks so much for watching. Till next time.